got a thing for you Hustle with them dealers when it's time to get that bling for you Knock it out the ring for you Oh, shorty, oh Start off this segment, I'm going to address someone. I'm going to be addressing baby girl, the little girl inside of me. And it's a little touchy because, you know, anytime you have to address yourself, it's a bit more, it's a little bit more what's the term it's a little bit more uh, I don't know I'm gonna come back to it but anytime you have to be honest with yourself anytime you gotta confront the person that's that you're looking at in the mirror it is about 10 times probably even 100 times harder than when you can look at someone else and just boom off the bat tell them whatever it is that's wrong so I say all that to say I'm a dress baby girl today. Okay. We going to get into some some things that we need to get off our chest and you know, we going to really back in after. Okay? Dear baby girl, I've abandoned you, neglected you. Neglected your needs and your desires to be you. Your unapologetic, lighthearted, loving, free spirit has been lost and casted away. To a degree, I have been very much so cautious simply because in reality, people are bad. Mm, Some of them. And my guards are always in place to protect you. As I've grown older, I noticed I became a people pleaser, the nice girl, a girl <clears throat> a girl that was always there to give the greatest advice but failed to take heed to her own doings i became super giving of my spirit of you to people that didn't deserve that i've fallen through on responsibilities with some because I simply just felt that I always needed to be there to prove to others I loved and supported them and always felt the need to multitask people's energies and desires before yours. As I hear this (laughs) again and putting it on wax, I've really abandoned you, like literally abandoned you. So, With evaluation comes assessment. I'm now in the process of addressing things, whether it's good or bad, about myself. Baby girl, I am putting you first now. Your healing is necessary to my growth. My growth as a woman, a daughter, a sister, a friend, a professional, And in due time, a wife and a mommy to be. To heal, I've been revisiting things that I've always enjoyed as a young girl. So there's some things like, you know, (laughs) just having my own concerts in my room, in the car. I will replay the same songs over and over and over and over again because that's what I want to do. That's what makes me happy, okay? Doing my makeup, um, talking to old friends, reminiscing on old times, talking about new times, talking about business ventures, all these things with these old friends because of that connection, I am somebody that craves connections all the time. Like, we're, we're going to get into that in another segment. But, yes. <laughs> um, talking to old friends. Um, watching crime shows like psychological thrillers. That's one of my faves. Um, taking hot showers for 20 minutes or more. Like, it's just so excessive. But I'm just so extra. And I just so love it. <laughs> Um, also 
spending more time with my family and the ultimate fave is shopping and now here I am with this podcast type video and this is something that I've always wanted to do I've always enjoyed you know like I said stated before like I always enjoyed giving advice or just you know being like a voice of reason to people and here I am doing this so again I'm doing things that I love now I'm addressing you and I'm making you happy okay so what I've noticed is that I've been happier since I adhered to your cry and I started my healing process so I got a long way to go because I already know that nothing great comes easy and comes fast and there's far more respect and time given to a soul that has value so baby girl I love you I want to apologize for abandoning you I want to apologize for neglecting you and neglecting your needs and your desires and putting everybody else first before you and we're just gonna nip it in the butt now okay I love you and anytime that I feel that I'm falling off my rocker I have to remember that you are the one that are, is the propeller in my success of growing and to becoming the most beautiful woman that I aspire to be and that I am. I love you.